I got the idea to do a flip classroom when I took part in an iTunes U boot camp um, out in Cupertino at Apple headquarters. And then I started playing with the iTunes U platform and I realized it gave me a lot of flexibility in terms of how I could present my course content to my students in a way that I think they would learn better and more effectively. I actually had the opportunity to use the iPad yesterday. I went to the Union to cover a story and I brought the iPad with me and I was like able to sit and take notes on the iPad and pictures and video. The combination of the iPad with iTunes U and the Flip Classroom has allowed my students to take their learning wherever they go. Our whole class today, we could we can spend working on our stories and um, going out. Like today, people actually went out and they did some uh, looking for stories and stuff like that. I mean, you're not really able to do that if you don't have a flipped classroom because we already went over all the actual textbook information before we came in. For example, if I go to yesterday's and I watch this video, you can click here to take notes while you're watching it. And if I click here, it has like the little notes that I took while the video was playing. We had one student who came in during class and she said she had a story idea that was taking place at uh, our student union and we didn't even say another word to her, we just said go. And we literally sent her out with her iPad and had her go and uh, start reporting an assignment. She had only been in class for three weeks. In normal circumstances, she would have had the preliminary concepts down for reporting. In this case, because she had the experience of the flipped classroom, she'd learned twice as much material. She had her iPad, so she could do all of her reporting, all of her research. She could interact with us on Twitter, so she could ask us questions in class. And she went out there and not only reported that story, but had it in the hands of our student newspaper within two hours, and it was on the front page of the paper the next day.